Yes, this one's going out to Morrigan. This is the theme of the worst man in the world. <clears throat> Geese Howard. Moose Coward. This motherfucker's always plus. Uh, okay, yeah, you're you're right, Nicholas. Negan Walking Dead is worse. <laughs> Start playing Blood Bowl today. Seems pretty cool. It made me want to play physical Blood Bowl, like a tabletop version of it. And then I was like, uh, maybe, uh... Then I thought about how much RNG stuff there is, and maybe that, that wouldn't be that fun. I don't know. I mean, I know some of it's dice stuff, but... I mean, I don't care about the fact that the RNG exists, Meme Shard. I care about having to do it all myself. Like, like fumble directions, stuff like that. Like, figuring out, like, which pathing and stuff like that. Like, yikes. I don't want to do that myself. I want the computer to do it for me. Waffle review? The waffle was fine. It was just an Eggo waffle with uh, peanut butter on it. I need a little bit, of, little, little bit of protein to get me through the stream. Blood Bowl 3 is scheduled for this year, I think, uh, Tower Pitha. Are there new, oh, are there new Blood Bowl rules for, for 2020? Nice. I will have to look into those. I, um... Food chat starting early. Yeah, well, I don't know. It's pretty. It's pretty integral to the, the stream. Passing and agility are different stats now. Oh, cool. And elves are so elves are less bullshit. Good to know. Ooh, just order Japanese food. That sounds really good. What? What's uh? What's everybody's like? Go to non sushi Japanese food order. I feel like sushi has really sort of dominated the. Uh, Japanese like delivery and takeout market here in the states. That yeah, ramen. Yeah, ramen. Ramen's a very good good pull. Katsu. Katsu is great. Yeah, the uh, chicken or pork katsu done. Oh, hey, Terrence, how you doing? Yaki soba. These all sound so good. Y'all are making me very very hungry. Curry udon. I've never had curry udon. Katsu is, is extremely good, though. Okonomiyaki. I've had that. Wait, no. Uh, no. Wait. Yes, I've had Okonomiyaki, naki, but not uh, not Takoyaki. Uh, Terrence is zand. Oh, yes, I have had the cabbage pancake. That thing rips. Oh, let me just throw it at the chat screen. Hello. Um... McGriddles, 4 a.m. Japanese McDonald's. That does sound good. I just ordered a burger, Dirt McGirt. What kind of burger? What you got on that burgie? I got a takeout burger last night. Got some General So's gone. Love those. Chocolate covered raisins. Oh, baby. That's really good. I um, I for Christmas my family got me a whole bunch of um British treats. Uh, 
including a couple of Cadbury's Dairy Milk bars, and one of them was the uh, fruit and nut variety. And I was like, I don't want to eat fruit and nut. I, I, yeah, I got a bunch of digestives. I was like, I don't want to eat fucking fruit and nut Cadbury's. And then I went in there, and it was really fucking good. Because it's like, it, it is almost like the... It's the chocolate raisin effect, because it's... It's like cranberries or raisins in there or something like that, and they're 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 dried, so it's it's like the effect of a chocolate raisin, but with really good chocolate. Yeah, really enjoyed it. Um, I also I got some hobnobs. I have a. Uh, a Cadbury's orange chocolate Yule log, which is almost sort of a, almost sort of a, it's like a cake. I haven't cracked into it. It looks like a snack cake of somehow, some, 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 some kind of snack cake, but it looks good. Uh, Rion, this is a. Hang on, let me look at the name name of the song for you. This is Cross of Fear from uh, Castlevania. This is the Rondo of Blood soundtrack. Some kind of snack cake. Perfect. Haunter says, I prefer digestive to hobnobs. I think I prefer hobnobs. I, li I like how substantial they are. Digestives go down easier and quicker. And in greater quantity, I can really only uh, eat like two hobnobs at once, which is good because it uh go goes goes a more slowly. I also have, yeah, Doom. I got a uh, I got a, a single sleeve of Jaffa cakes. Uh, I already ate all my uh, I already ate all my Cadbury's buttons. I already ate my Crunch Bar. Tim Tam. Oh, I also got penguins. Yes. Penguins are like Tim Tams, but with more stuff in them. Uh, because you can't use a, you can, you can do the Tim Tam slam with the Tim Tam, which I guess is where you bite both ends off a Tim Tam and then, uh, uh, slurp up the, your, your beverage through the, there's like a gap in the frosting inside the Tim Tam that you can use as a straw. Um, Penguins don't have that gap because it's fully frosted in there. Uh, dun, dun, dun. And yes, I did get chocolate orange for Christmas dirt McGirt. I got I got uh, a dark and a milk. I got so much fucking chocolate in my house right now. I never have this much chocolate. I don't buy chocolate. I don't buy I don't buy candy when I go to the grocery store because I know I'll only want to eat candy. But then Christmas comes around and people give me candy. The dark is really good, dirt. Chocolate oranges with popping candy. It sounds yes, Brett Brushy is mentioning that too. I've never had that. That sounds that sounds crazy. Yes, thank you, Sin. This is this is why we're wet bandit gaming today. It's because it's very cold in my apartment. And I look like a wet bandit. I look like both of the wet bandits became one guy. Um I got my uh, I got my my piece from above sweatshirt came in. Yay. Yes, this song is good. Uh, what does Faith do? Uh, last time I was in the office, I got my team chocolate oranges, but I forgot to tell them it was from me, so they're all really confused. That's funny. I got a, I, I received a, uh, a Target gift. It was, it was a little confusing, because it was a Target gift card for a Nintendo eShop card. And the person who sent it to me... I, I thought it was spam. I nearly deleted it because uh, it also came to my work address. Uh, 
Um, and something happened with like the gift card system where in the from field on it, it was from Patrick to Patrick. So later the person who sent it to me had to like reach out and be like, oh yeah, that was me. <laughs> um, Anyways, um, let's get into uh, our game for today. We're gonna we're gonna continue Mountain Blade Banner Lord because it's been fun. It is. I mean, Sin, I, I'm treating it like future me looking out for me because I, I sat there on the eShop page for like probably like 20 minutes just browsing through everything that was available slash on sale, thinking like, oh, should I finally buy Mario Kart because I don't own Mario Kart yet. And then I was like, there's definitely going to be a couple games coming out um, in, a, in a few weeks. Uh, not a few weeks, in a few months that I'll, I'll want to buy. The art by the monitor. That That's a, a, a John Wick print. Okay. I don't think I can push the focus manually back there. This guy's on autofocus. Patrick Mario Kart. Mario Kart. Mario Kart. It's true. I, I already have Garfield Kart. Jay, that's fine. Go, go, go watch AEW. I got this. I got this. Go watch those. Go watch those. Those cool guys. Remember when when Colt Cabana just showed up in our chat for some reason? I think that was during a Puro moods. I think that was we were watching some 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 Puro. Um. That happened with another streamer I was watching recently. I, he, he just spends a lot of time on Twitch. Uh, hello, Sylf. Sylf, how's Final Fantasy? How's the new Final Fantasy content? Is everybody happy with it? I mean, actually, don't answer that. Are you happy with it? Nice. Tripwire, that is true. Yeah, they uh, they they briefly. I, I mean, Sylph will be able to answer that, answer that with more accuracy. But I think they stopped handing out or stopped selling new accounts for a while to try to mitigate. Uh, additional load on their their poor servers. Um, let me uh, let me boot up the damn game. Also, wait, Monster Hunter Rise is out on PC now, isn't it? We're not gonna play that today, but it's out there. Fucking game, we're gonna play Mountain Blade. Duh. Ah, I see. Sylph says, login queues were very bad, so they stopped the, the free trial, etc. Monster Hunter Rise. Uh, Conway. I always forget that there's like a secondary launcher for Mountain Blade that I never see. Where is it? Show me it. God damn it. There it is. Double four. I think with the case of Mountain Blade, it's just that there's a lot of people love to mod it. Uh, and there's also like beta versions and like stuff like that, that, you know, you can usually play like a beta build of it. So I think in the specific case of Mount and Blade, their audience probably appreciates that there's a separate launcher for it so they can fiddle with all their mods and settings and stuff before they boot into the game. Uh, we'll be listening to that delicious Mount and Blade theme in just a second here. Just a second. Enjoy the silence.
Mount and to do. Good one, Bible. Donut. I want donut. Yeah, I'm talking about Mountain Dews, baby. Thank you, Engel. Here we go. Kind of want to get a green screen for my for my uh, streaming setup. I don't know. It's, I don't know where it'd fit though. I mean, I don't know where I'd put it where I wasn't using. It. I want to get one of the. I, I've I've seen the the pull up ones. Uh, Bloodfart Phoenix says important butter fact: the Empire has top level troops called Bucare. Bucalerari. No, Buca. Yeah. Buca. Laari? Which stands for. Which translates to biscuit eaters. Good for them. Sorry, I'm looking around my office seeing where I could, uh. Where I could fit a, um. One of those collapsible green screens. I guess I could like stand it up in the corner when I'm not using it. Update the diary. Thank you, Sin, for reminding me. We'll uh, we'll fill that out with with this theme music plays here. Let's get the diary open. Texas, thank you for that prime sub. Also, canola oil subbed up at the top of the stream for 24 whole months, two years. Where's my diary? There it is. Oh, oh, hang on. When I tap out of the game, the music stops. So I will play the diary music. What happened last time? What, what, what did we What did we do last time? We we oh we we saw fish and palm trees for the first time. Pig, I am the pig. How you doing, Kacho? Oh yeah, we did avenge our parents. It's kind of big. It's kind of a big news for us. Alright, well, let's let, I guess it's time for page three. We did lose a caravan, too. Uh, pretty good, Kacha. We're just getting started. We've been bullshitting for a little while, but we're getting into the gaming very shortly now. Uh, earmuffs, this is a... Uh, this is just a papyrus JPEG and a uh, OBS text layer over it with a funny font. Okay, so...
Okay. Uh, that's, that's... I found my small siblings. Because sometimes they would use F. F. Because, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know how fucking old typography worked. They were stupid. They didn't know how anything worked back then. Uh. So we're gonna, we're gonna keep struggling towards, uh... The, the um the goal of creating a caravan uh really we're at a point in this game where we need to start stabilizing our income because we have a lot of troops now we are supporting a lot of troops all by ourselves. Yes, we're becoming the Butter Baron Cowboy. Wait. I got really confused for a second there. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Butter trade. Uh, all right. Power influential. All right. Let's take on another escort caravan quest. Again, this is sort of on the job learning experience where we we don't own a caravan yet, but we're protecting one. So we're, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting close, right? We're, we're shadowing the trade. Uh, Mini Goblin says, what if you replace the medieval type S's with the cool S? They should have done that back then. Rent to own caravan, yes. Releasing a new caravan. I think about how fucked up it is that in my late twenties I got a job and I had to move to uh, to New York City and I no longer own a car. And for the last five years I've been in suspended animation when it comes to having to do a whole class of adult things. So the next time I need a car, I'm probably gonna be like 38, 30, 39, and I'm gonna have to bring my mom with me to help me. I'm, I'm not getting that experience in now. Could bring a friend, yeah, I guess. I trust my mom more though. <laughs> Do you have a license? It, it, it has lapsed. Um, because the other thing with with a mom is it's like, it's like, well, you're gonna you're gonna fucking do me dirty in front of my in front of my mom, right? Like they don't give a fuck about your friend. Fuck a friend. Um, all right. I heard you need help with the problem. All right, I'll escort the caravan myself. Now, hang on. This is one of our first opportunities to delegate. Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Um, yeah, we'll send uh, Death Weta. See how she does. That sucks, Cicada. Um, we'll give her some good troops to help her. Give her a crossbowman. Give her a, a footman to train up. You know, give her a couple footmen. Um, 
oh hey here's here's one of those uh biscuit eaters i'll i'll, I'll give her uh no she doesn't need a biscuit eater give her some more crossbowmen Hired blade. I don't know who that is, but you can go. Um, give her a couple mercenary guys. Infantry. Nice little mixed bag. Take a uh, spearman with you. Give her one more. We'll give her a. Hello, Horcock. Driving is either boring or incredibly terrifying. There's no in-between. Now, let me introduce you to a fun friend called the manual transmission. Uh, it, that makes, it makes driving more fun. It gives you a thing to do while you're driving. Take that guy, too. I guess I can understand how you would be too. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, Mixo, you can work on your, your quarter circle forwards while you while you drive that manual transmission. You can work on your input. You can work on your Korean back dash by uh, quickly shifting into uh, reverse and then into neutral and then reverse then into neutral and then reverse and then into neutral. Yeah, I used to have a 45-minute commute each way to work. Um, all right, let's see what other, other tasks there are for us in this town. Merchant Caravan. Well, I already did that, right? Yeah, I already, I already took that one. Oh, wait, there's two of those quests. I can do that quest for any of these atheist YouTubers. Uh, what does this guy need? Rival gang. Let's get involved in a gang war. All right, a margarine. Yep, 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 yep. Keeps the peace in the back alleys. Stay out of my business, I'll stay out of yours. Heard you need some help with the problem. Slow hand, Avigos. Uh, he's been coming around robbing dice players and drinkers. What do you need me to do? Uh, we're preparing an attack, but we need more time to gather our men. Meet here in Ortizia after three days, and we'll strike them together. Can't do that right now. Let me just make sure that I'm not, like, doing any other deals with this guy. I'm not currently dealing with slow hand and he already doesn't like me, so we're gonna take this quest. Cinnamon, yeah. Cinnamon's a great name. Um I don't know, he has an olive press for sale. That's very cool. That's pretty poggers, bro. I love it when a guy who owns an olive press goads me into a gang war. So the last time I did one of these gang war missions, I got absolutely fucked up. So I'm excited to maybe make a mistake right now and then have Deathuetta the Wrong come back from her escort mission and find me in absolute shambles. That's true, Cicada. That is, that is competition to the butter business. So maybe we'll backstab this guy once we've earned his trust. Um, all right, so now we just got to wait three days. Let's uh, check the tavern district real quick. See if there's any good trade going on, any good trade to be done. Oh right, I picked up a bunch of loot from uh, some some guys. Is 
Ooh, nope, I'm saving that. That's mine. A lot of tat tattered arm wraps. Big run on tattered arm wraps. Um. All right, that's 410. Anything good for me here? Short sword. What am I swinging now? Uh, that is better swing speed, but less damage. More thrust. I don't like. I don't like thrust attack. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna keep rocking what I got right now. Very good, Rose. <laughs> Length is very important in MMB, says Conway. That's a good tip. That, um, and it makes sense, I guess. Let me let me see what what I got. My scalpel is one hundred twenty. Yeah, th this is all baby shit. That's right, Jay. Double Forte, I, I, I'm, I did not know that you played this game, and I'm glad that we got another Mountain Blade head in chat to, to do, do the good kind of backseating. Alrighty, let's uh, let's just wait then until uh, it's time for a gang war. <clears throat> Has it been three days yet? Let's take a pause and let's go talk to uh, Cinnamon. Hey, I'm ready to do the gang war. All right, he's, he's, he, he wants me to keep waiting. Well, fine. I'm just bleeding money into my troop payments while we're sitting here, but... Here we go. Cinnamon, Aranikos. All right, let's go meet him. Are you ready to fight? I am ready. That's interesting, Double Four Take. I, 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 this is my first time playing a Mountain Blade game, so I don't have the perspective of what uh, Warband eventually became to to weigh into to my feelings about this one. I, I, I'll say it like, yeah, I'm only like 10 hours into this and I'm already seeing tons of repeated quest formats. Um, so I can see that being a, a limitation. Okay, so these are not my own lads. I'm just... I am... This is way below my station. They didn't leave, let me bring my fucking shield? Wait, did I not... Let me see if I... Okay, I can't access inventory in battle. Alright. Hey, guys. Coming to fight me, eh? Did Cinnamon or any coast put you up to this? Look, there's no need for bloodshed. This town is big enough for all of us. But if bloodshed is what you want, I'm happy to provide. Look at this guy's homies. Look at this guy's crew. Look at those dead-eyed stares. Well, let's, let's talk to him. Uh, 
Okay, so I can either get a thousand gold from this guy and betray the other guy. Um, or... Or, uh, that is Lionel Richie. Or, um... Do, do I take the money? Or do I fight? I don't have any particular allegiance to either of these guys. I, I will say, the last time I got this mission, I immediately changed sides, and then the side that I changed to got fucking wrecked. And I, boy, did I have egg on my face. Let's fight. That's true, I, I cannot betray Cinnamon. My, my word is bond. It'd be funny, right? It'd be funny if I just ran away. Nice. We love tactics. Now I just got to note. I just I noticed that in the town, the game runs fine on here, but over in OBS it gets kind of overloaded. And I got the the encoding overloaded notification, which means next time I play this game, I might have to switch from GPU encoding to uh, CPU encoding to see if that helps. I love tactics. Tactics rock. I want to get good at tactics. Uh, I, I've been watching... C Cicada's been posting um, stuff from Total Warhammer in the Discord. And I'm really curious. I, I'm both very curious and very intimidated by it. Um... You can bring some of your own soldiers to these fights. Oh. So if you... So if you turn, you have to... Okay, you have to fight your own troops, risking killing them. That's great. Alright. Cinnamon, you got anything else for me? Oh, oh hang on. No, that, that's Canman, not Cinnamon. Uh, what does this Cooper want? I'm boring. Um, where's my second party? Can I see them on the map? I leave town. And I zoom way out. Where's, uh... Where's my wife? Where's my wife? Hell, you can check on them. Solving issue. She was last seen in Ortizia three days ago. Very well. I assume she'll come back to me when she's done. Is, do they not physically appear on the map to do this step? Okay, she'll, she'll rock back up when she's done. Um... Well, I, w I won't kick her out of the clan then. Let's uh, let's do that other, mm, yeah, let's do that other merchant caravan quest. Even though we might be overbooking ourselves here. Uh... No, let's not do this. Let, let, let's do the the stupid. Uh... We'll do a a tournament. We'll do a tournament. Let's bet. All right, we're getting 
cured studded leather armor. Ooh la la. If we win, we gotta win. <laughs> Bit of hesitation on that one. Oh, Jinda, you fucked up. I'm about to plug a USB device from here. Uh, hopefully it doesn't fuck anything up, but I forgot this was plugged in. Ready? We're okay. All right. I'm not in this next round. Let's watch it. Siri, yeah, I forgot to... Wait, hang on. The tournament part of The Witcher 3, is that only in a... It's in the, the Blood and Wine DLC, right? Sure did. I never finished Blood and Wine. Yeah, I did, um, Snow White. I did, I think I did all the DLC other than Blood and Wine. I did the one with the funny ghost wedding. I did the one where you go inside like a painting or something like that. Um. And then I did Hearts of Stone. That's the one that I did, yeah. And then I started Blood and Wine. And I think I, I got I got a winery. And then I think I just, I think I moved. I think that was right around the time that I moved and I sort of fell off. All right, this is my round. Let's bet on ourselves and get in there. I got a shield, I got a sword. 100 bad guys with swords. Look how tiny that guy was. Can you believe how tiny that guy was? <laughs> That's right, Morgan. <laughs> All right. One on one. Jinda is just dropping the ball all fucking day. Mirror match. He's tiny. I guess I, I guess I did make Jinda as large as possible. So if Malub the Scholar is as short as possible, it makes sense that I'm like a head and a half taller than him. Sorry, I made Margarine as tall as possible, not Jinda. Get in there. Let's bet on ourselves. Let's bet big. Die. 
Fuck yeah. Finals, here we go. Imperial Sergeant Crossbowman. Well, sounds like... You're bringing a crossbowman to a sword fight. Yeah. Zoned. Block punished. Uh. Counter hit. Cool, we just got some new armor. Let's check out that armor, see if I can wear that. That is an improvement. Cool. Fucking cool. Everybody be nice to Sin. Sin is very tall. We're the respectful gamers here. Oh, thank you, Conway. Good tip. Can a civilian carry a shield? No. Oh, hang on. An iron scimitar. No, just a sword. Okay. Okay, cool. I'll fuck around with this this uh this in the future. Put a horse? A, civ a civilian horse? I I I need specifically need a civilian horse. I have my war horse and my civilian horse. I guess it makes sense, right? Like this is for like uh I can have a fancy horse for like fancy affairs and stuff. If I can learn how to 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 ride a, a camel. Um, then I'm going to show up. Yes, I'm going to show up on the Huns Free whenever I get the chance. All right, cool. Well, done. All right, I got 34 lads at the ready. I got 10 off doing a quest for me. They'll be back in a few days. Uh, let's go ahead and bite the bullet and take that, take this quest. Nope, oh, did I just leave? Sorry. I want to form a caravan in this town. 10,000, okay. I don't have that much money. You... Which one of you freaks had a caravan quest? I guess it was this guy. Okay. Ooh, buttered noodles in honor of the Butter Kingdom. That sounds nice. Well, speaking of butter, it's been a while since we did any good old-fashioned butter trade. Uh, let's see if we can scout any butter rumors. Um... There we go. And scoop some butter deals. Okay. Uh, butter is fair. This is not a huge markup on butter, but it's not a good buying price on butter. There's some good sales at Kayaz, which is good to know. But we're going to just roam the countryside for a bit and see if we can uh, find some good butter deals. See if we can't find a butter deal. Butter noodles sounds really good. It's been years since I've had butter noodles. Hang on. Come here. Come here, bandits. I'm gonna kick your damn ass. Don't raid that town. Don't you dare raid that town.
Good one, Gotcha. We like that. Oh, I love marinara. I love marinara and butter. You know, not you know, not really. To, holy shit! Look at all these fucking guys. These guys aren't mine. These guys, I don't command these guys. But that's a lot of fucking guys. All right. Well, I'm gonna put my boys. This is the, look at the, this is the response for seven, seven looters, seven bandits. All right. You get your ass over here. Uh, archers. Yes, archers get behind there. Uh, oh, cool, you can put a, a commander for, for formations. Commander's mounted. Oh, I see. So you should be a commander of the horse, horse archers. Oh yeah, Katja, this is, uh, I think this is that patch that dropped earlier this week, uh, or last week or something. Seems pretty cool. Okay. Well, I don't think this is gonna, I don't think we really need to think that hard about tactics here. I'm just gonna say charge all. What's the shortcut to hire everybody or call everybody? There we go. And yeah, they also added the slow mo mode and command mode. Yeah, that's right, Clay. This is, uh, it's got sort of chivalry ish combat. It's much, much more simpler than chivalry's combat, but it's, yeah, it's got strategy, it's got. The, the the tactics thing. Um. Hey, somehow we won. There's a lot of yelling. Yes, yeah, I I just got these. I just won these shoulder pads in the tournament, and I'm loving them. Hey, right, let's see if uh, Garangolia has any good butter bargains. Actually, this guy has somebody I can talk to. Let me, I'm going to talk to that guy in a minute here once I check products. Grain. Well, scoop up some grain for my boys. My lads love grain. My, my, my guys are always eating grain. They're always going on and on about how much they fucking love grain. And I'm like, all right, guys. Whatever you say. All right, let's go talk to this, this big army and see if, uh, if they want to be our friends. I am Madrin. Crotor, of the house of Dionikos. My family has stood in the Senate and discharged its duties honorably since the first days of the empires. I am Lord of Legata. Um, I know your name well. Those bandits back there didn't give us too much trouble. Nice. Hang on, can you tell me anything about the Battle of Pendrak? I wasn't there, but I know Lucan has some thoughts about it. All right, whoever the fuck that is, I'll look them up later. Um, heard you might need help with the problem. Don't think you can help. Don't have enough troops. Well, fuck you. Ooh, I would like to propose an alliance between our families through marriage. Now, I know I got a thing going with Jinda, and I know I got a thing going with, with Deathuera, but what if I also got married? I could also offer to enter the service, but I don't think I have enough homies yet to do that. Okay, first, let's offer marriage, and if he's like, nah, I'll be like, well, maybe we can just be friends, and you can, and I can work for you. Ooh, looking for a suitable marriage for Meritor? Ugh! <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, 
you know. Maybe. So let's learn a little bit about Meritor. He's a member of the Dionikos, a noble family of the Empire that is backing Garios in the Civil War. It's a reputation of being cautious but trustworthy. He is a prisoner, says Buttmaster. <laughs> is he a pri is he currently a prisoner? Yes, he he has been taken prisoner by Ergeon of the Batanian, so we would need to do a little bit of a prison break before we could marry this guy. He's honest, he's cautious, and he's calculating. He's very good he's okay at trade. He's good at one handed swords work. Very good at riding horses, very good at archery and the leadership. I don't know, he, like, he's, he's kind of cute, right? Like, he's like... I think we should, we should maybe try to get married to this guy. And here's the thing, is like, if, if it doesn't go well, we can like maybe kill him or something. No, Meme Shark, we don't know that. We're, we're never gonna know. We're gonna do it. We're gonna we're gonna see. We're, again, we're we're getting ourselves into a situation where we're gonna have to get him out of jail before we can marry him. But that's what good marriages are made of, right? Like, if if you don't fight for it, what's the point? Yeah, I'll marry your cousin or whatever. Very good. Uh oh uh oh hang on wait i don't need to pay a fucking uh, like i don't want you to release any prisoners I don't, I don't need shit from you guys i'm i'm just like psh, let's just get married you, do you need a what is it called that a a uh a dowry that do they need a dowry i'll give you a fucking sword i don't care I, I can make demands. Get that bread. Yeah, you're right. Fuck you, pay me. Um, I mean, I need 10,000 dinars. To get my business started. So, you know, let's ask for a business loan of 20000 I get 20,000 dinars. You get one iron spatha and this fine ass. Now it's not it's, it's not letting me offer this. It's it's not it's not allowing me to offer this. So I think I might be making a mistake. Cow? Ask for a cow too? Hell yeah, I'll ask for a cow. Zondri, that's fair, but I feel like in this brutal world, uh the marriage might be a step along the path to business. And marriage doesn't mean anything in the Middle Ages. You can He's gonna die anyways. Okay, auto offer will set it to something they like. Oh, no, 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 no. That's all my money and my camels. Goodbye. Okay. Yeah, let's work for this guy. We we are now of the uh, Western Empire. We can we can leave them at some point. You know, our primary hustle is still the. Uh, maybe it's because I asked for the twenty thousand. Well, you know, when I when I switched to the auto offer, it took that away. 
I think, unless that was still on there. Oh, it was, it was leaving the 20K up is what changed it. Well, shit, hang on. Moderate. Um... No, yeah, no, it doesn't matter if the 20K is on there. They still want... They still want mad shit from me. They want literally all of my money. Oh, you can charm the person. No, it's okay. We're, we're, we're done. Bye. Bye-bye. So now I have enemies, I guess, right? Like, that's the... The other thing that's going on here is that I, uh... I, now I have allies, which means I also have enemies. Good point, Durzo. Yeah, maybe I can just find Meritor in jail and seduce him there. Hey, Death Weta leveled up. Um, okay. Buy products. Butter. Not a great price on butter. How are my boys doing? I think my boys de deserve some hog. And provide some hog for the lads. Um, get them some cheese, too. That's expensive cheese. No, no thank you. Hog. You are now meat. Uh, let's see. This is that's what I, that logo is. Salt, I think. Um, let's check around Jalmaris. I don't think we've ever been to Jalmaris. It looks like uh, Death Weta has returned to me. My, my party size is back up to 45, so I think they caught up with us. Now, what's your deal? Uh, villagers? Okay. Kingdom screen is unlocked on the, the bottom bar now. Thank you for the heads up. Cool. God, this is a lot to take in. Okay, so here's all the fiefdoms. Is it fief or fife? I know that you play the fife. Fief, fiefdom. Okay. Policies. Armies. Man, nah, butter's too pricey still. What about my character screen here? Oh, I, I get to choose a perk for my brother. Okay. Ooh, cool. Wow, I get to choose a lot of perks for my brother. Holy shit, this guy's strong. Um... I mean, he's not in my party right now. Kidgefork just got all my wisdom teeth stolen. It sucked. Okay, you can do that. Swift strike. Yeah, I want my brother to use axes. Trap. 
trainer. Increases your hit points by two. And keep him safe from arrows. Garrison wages. Oops. That's okay. I'll fuck around with that stuff later. Um, well, not, not a whole lot of interesting stuff going on in this town. Um, God, we need to get our income up. All right, we have 8,000 right now. And I will get money every time I de destroy enemies of their army. I don't think I'm strong enough to like go fight the enemies of my, my lords yet. I think I probably need to grind a little while longer on like caravan quests and stuff. Um, 12 point K for the, okay. 12,000 for the good caravan. That's good to know. Um, let's, um, you can join the army. If, if, I mean, I I did sign up with I, I just signed up with the uh, these guys to to serve them, and I get money every time I defeat their enemies now. Um, but I don't think I'm going to be strong enough to like attack groups of groups of their enemies. Let's check Zayonica. Let's see what's up. Hang on, hang on. Looters, bandits, banditos. Let's get those asses. There's ten of them. I think they're moving faster because they're in the woods. Get him. But I think once we're on open land, I'll catch up. Yep. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Surrender or die, brigand. Oh, I can attack enemy villages. That's exciting and scary. F1, F3. Get their asses! Get their asses! JDD, I, I, I like it. I, I didn't, I'm not a person to ask who's like, I, I did not play a warband or anything. I'm having a ton of fun with this, but I don't have a lot of Mountain Blade experience, so... There is a bunch of people in the chat who might be able to answer better than me. I think the general consensus is that it, it's it's good and it has a ton of potential, but it's uh, not as feature-rich as uh, Warband was. F6? F1? No. Well, I can't right now, but I want to see what F6 does. These guys are having a great time. Oh, cool. Double Horde says it delegates fighting formation decisions to your commanders. Cool. Uh, oh, yeah, we were heading down to uh, Zayanika. Long way down the mountain pass. Yeah, let's check out this town real quick. Yeah, there's a, a lot of looters scooting around out here. What, what's your problem? Bandit base. Yes, please. Okay, 
There it is. Oh, cool. There's even a little uh, scribble on the map now that tells you precisely where you need to go. All right. W what's your butter deal like? No, no butter, but you got hog. We're good. Hang on, special. These are mountain bandits. They're fast. Giddy up. Giddy up. Giddy up on his ass. When attacking hideouts, do F3, F2. Then the tried and true F1, F3. Okay. F3, F2. I'm going to try to remember that. Hang on. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm going I'm to see what that does right now. All right, ready? You do F2, F3, which would... Stand apart! Stand apart, okay. Oh, F3, F2. Ooh, I, I did it wrong. F3, F2. Then... F1, F3. In hideouts, fire at will. Yeah, score in this game is great. Footman, you shall now be a spearman. Letting them charge off the bat will get them killed in hideouts, guaranteed, says Double Forte. Huh, okay. We get to take 10 lads with us. I don't know if cavalry will be super helpful in this attack, but we're going to bring our... We're going to bring... No, no cavalry. I think we start on foot in these ones anyways. Um, yeah, we'll bring a legionary. We'll bring... Yeah, we'll bring a couple of uh, archers. We love archers. We'll bring our Batanian hero. And a highborn warrior. No, we're gonna we're gonna bring uh bring our Asarai friends too. See how they prove themselves. Lavender Dame says, I'd like to take some guys who have shields to fight hideouts, put a shield wall up and charge. That's smart. I don't think I brought many shields. Uh, I brought some shielded guys. Hang on. So if we go Wango, uh, and then shield wall is F2. Cool. And then I tell these. Uh, so I'm going to tell... What classes of lads do I have here? I have archers. Alright, I'm gonna tell the archers to stick with me. 
Um, no, go back. How do I go back? F1. I'm going to tell you boys to, to stick with me. And then I'm going to tell these lads to charge. Yeah, Rotten Witch, you should be able to just be a, a, a little guy who eats berries in the woods if you want to, if that's how you want to play the game. Um, now, archers, I would love it if you arched. No, hang on. Um, yeah, I haven't played it much. Uh, you can do a whole lot, I think, with just dis diplomacy, but I don't know how much of the game there is or how fun the game is to play if you don't uh, get out there and swang a sword. I don't think it's, it's I don't think it's quite as compelling f as like Crusader Kings in terms of just like raw diplomacy and funny situations. Speaking of, I really want to play Crusader Kings. Probably not on stream. Um, I think it'll probably just be a pack game. Oh, cool. Admiral Half Nelson says new Crusader Kings DLC coming soon. Die! Die! A lot of role play focus stuff. Oh, that's cool. I remember a. Uh, when we played it with Clayton, he showed us the uh, uh, <laughs> he showed us the, uh, the the skateboarding mod, Lavender Dame. It is on Game Pass if you can uh, spare the the monthly fee of Game Pass. Unfortunately, it's not on Xbox. It's just uh, yeah, yeah. It, it it is on Game Pass, and I think there were some pretty good Game Pass deals recently. Boy, that guy hit me pretty hard. But right, we're losing, guys. We lost a recruit. That's all right. Oh, we lost two guys. Two deaths. Oh, both the uh, Asarai recruits that we picked up down south have bit it. Sinman, I do have uh, I have Monster Hunter on PC. I have not done anything on my save yet, um, but I have it. I have a code, and I have it downloaded. I'm teetering back and forth on whether or not I'm going to invest time in it. My gut says, like, maybe I will circle back around to it in a while. Like, ugh, maybe later this year if there's a lull of games kind of like I went back to Monster Hunter World on PC and then just went insane on Monster Hunter World on PC for like six months. Um, I might do that. But I don't think I'm going to really have time to play it for a while between all of the other, between tech and, and this and wanting to play Crusader Kings and Elden Ring. Morgan, I'm so fucking excited for Elden Ring. I'm I'm about to ready ready for uh, some extreme 
extreme uh, humble brag problems. Because I, I know it's still really hard to get a PS5, so I feel very, very bad for complaining about a PS5-related problem. But the PS5 controller sucks shit, and mine has really bad joystick drift right now. Uh, I guess the other thing I'll add is that it's not my PS5. It belongs belongs to the, the company. Um, I might... I might... I need to, to send out the controller for service if it's still under warranty uh, or just buy my own PS5 controller because I don't want to play Elden, Elden Ring with, with Drift. Yes, when I say the company, I mean uh, Wayland Dutani. Damn, they had some nice gear. Can't wait to sell this. I mean, it was not nice gear, but it's gear that will net me a tidy profit. I've never been to Poros. Let's check out Poros. Poros, Poros. There are big gangs of mountain bandits out here. Caravan ambush. Oh ho ho. Wait, th you this flute noise as your text notification? Or the the default flute like Really? Wait, did you play Mountain Blade Morgan? I didn't know that. I didn't know that about you. Alright, um... Let's, let's take on this quest from Amon, Amnon. I own a wood weavery. Heard you need help with a problem. Caravans too fast, yada 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 yada. Small ones you just get through, but there's a new bandit chief, a clever one, outfitted his men with fast horses. You got a fast horse. Okay, so we've lost several caravans. He'll outrun any large group that goes for him, but I've got a plan. We'll use bait. I've got some of my workers to spread rumors about a particularly fat caravan laden with silverware heading out towards Zeonica. It's a trap, of course. I got a bunch of mercenaries going with it. This sounds really fun, disguised as packers, but they could use some backup. Follow the caravan, stay at a proper distance until they are attacked, then move in to engage the bandits once and for all. My agent, caravan master, will pay you 934 when the fight is over. This sounds sick. Uh, you should send a good commander with 28 men, just to be safe. I'll send them back to you in 15 days. No, I'll do it myself. Excellent. The caravan will be leaving soon. I'm counting on you. Okay. Let's take a quick dip in the tavern. We're not going to let this one get away from me this time. Um. Uh, we're going to go to the tavern district and... Whew, that's a lot of prisoners. Uh, and we're also going to sell our shit.
just imagine this this fucking this woman right here comes into your shop and just drops 15 to 20 pairs of boots on your counter and says how much how much how much I'm gonna melt down some weapons in the smithy. Schmelt. Uh, yeah, let me smelt a wooden hammer. Wait, why, why won't it let me? Am I too dumb? Alright, that's fine. Out of charcoal. Good, good, good to know. Alright, so now we are going to leave town. And now we're just going to wait here until we see that caravan leave. There it is. Right? Yes. I don't know what a safe distance is. I assume this is it. Okay, th they will stop moving. It seems like they, they stop moving. I'm just going to say ride to Zayonica and see if that does it. I think this is them. Yep, that's them. Here we go. Uh, gamer writes, there should be. Mountain Blaze. All right, so they got 35 lads. I don't know where exactly the battle is happening. Um, it looks like they haven't crashed over us yet. We're going to take our infantry, put them at here. We're going to give them shield walled command once we're in there. Uh, we're going to take our archers. Stick them behind. There we go. Uh, now, I wish we were commanding these guys, because I don't want these guys to, like, run forward and fucking ruin my... my. I usually like to wait them, do a shield wall, and then wait for them to come to me. I've been doing this thing that people in the chat suggested. Get them into my range of fire, shield wall, arrows, and then cavalry charge, just to sort of bait them around under the fire of my, my archers. I don't know what these guys are going to do over on my left, so I might have to uh, call an audible once we're out there. I'm going to command you guys, um, and Soldiers! Forward! that sucks pliable, Can actually pre-formation everybody. Wait, wait, I, I can tell these guys to go shield wall now? Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. Yeah, cool. Okay. Soldiers. Charge. Archers. Follow. Horse boys, follow me, Psychos! and uh, Soldiers! Soldiers, 
Oh, we're getting arched. Oh, we should have stayed put. Come here, you fuck. Oh! <laughs> Did you see the... the <laughs> We're losing some guys, but... Get his ass. Get his ass! Jinda, no! Jinda's dead! She's, she's not dead. Is she? Is she dead? I don't see any... Any dead from my party. Jinda's okay. I can see her parachute. Look! I can see their parachutes! They're okay. Thank you. Thank you, Rian. She's just gonna take a little vacation. Hardened crossbowman. Woodrunner can become a raider or a skirmisher. That sounds cool. I want a raider. Hardly know her. Cool. I mean, when we sell this stuff, we might nearly be, uh, might, might nearly be to, uh, caravan territory. Oh, you can always click the arrow at top transfer all loot and prisoners. I, I, I will consider that from now on. I do kind of like clicking it a lot. It feels good. Thank you, my lady. Amnon the Wool Weaver informed me that help would be on the way. We needed it. I think that was a pretty tough lot. Take these goods as compensation. We got goods. We got goods. We got 12.3k. Let's uh, let's cruise to Zayonica and see uh, what we can move this stuff for. I love goods.
All right, and a first tavern district. Cancel. Go to the tavern district. Ransom some prisnos. Some quiznos. Quiznos? Hmm. Thinking about, is quiznos good? Chat, is, is quiznos good? Do we like quiznos? I used to like quiznos, but now I'm thinking about quiznos and all I can taste is salt. All I can imagine tasting is salt. Quiznos pretty tasty. Hot Italian pretty tasty. I do remember they they, they got the uh, they they got Weebles stuff to do those Sponge Monkey ads for them. Some hardwood, got some steel, got a pilgrim hood. Many boots. Velvet. Ooh la la. Hides, yeah, I'll sell those. All right, gang, we got 14K. <sighs> I feel like we're going to be caravan poor if we buy a caravan now. But we're going to do it. Okay, well, there's many goods around the town that can bring goods, money, and trade for them. A caravan you form will do this just fine. You need at least yada yada to hire 29 caravan guards. To form a caravan, you'll need one companion to lead them. Well, we gotta say goodbye to our wife. You need a companion with trade skill, so I hope you have that. Well, let me check. I must leave now. Goodbye. Let me see what my companions are like. Uh, Death Weta is very stupid when it comes to trade. She She's very dumb. She barters backwards. Is what it looks like here. Um, let's check our other friend. Jinda, on the other hand, is also very stupid. Now, I think maybe the problem here is I keep going into bars and approaching women dressed in 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 wolf skins who tell me about all of the enemies that they've destroyed and then I'm like hey you want to run a business for me That's true, Cicada. Hey, anybody in here know how to do a business? Hey, fucker. Ransom broker. I don't want to talk to Ransom broker. Malub the Scholar. Now, maybe this guy knows a little something something about how to run a bimbus. This is the guy that I, I've whipped this guy's ass in the arena like five times now. And I'm like, uh, let's let's subjugate this manlet. Uh, 
Alright, yadda 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 yadda, okay. Alright. Well, let's check. I, I, I didn't know how to check this guy's skills before I hired him, so let's check right now. He is... Garbage at trade. Absolutely garbage at trade. You can check with him without physically going to the tavern. He's not a scholar of trade. What is he a fucking scholar of? Oh, medicine. I guess I guess he's very good at medicine. <laughs> That's good though. We we need a surgeon. I'll, I will uh, I, I will assign him as our surgeon. He's lucky. Blood Fart Phoenix says if you press N for Encyclopedia, you can look up all Wanderers and their skills. Oh, cool. Um, well, let me let me make this guy my surgeon real quick. Captain. Yo. <laughs> He's, gonna... <laughs> He's gotta look up so far to see our eyes. <laughs> uh... <laughs> the Lavender Dame says Wanderers with trade skill will have names like the Spice Vendor, the Swift, or Bitter Draft as their title. That that kicks ass. Um So these are heroes. Wanderer. There we go. Ozia long knife. Top skills there, yeah. Somebody with a long knife, not good at Jinda the of the Butterman. Oh okay, that that that's my Jinda. Okay. I thought there was another Butterman out there and I was gonna have to go fucking kill them. Wara, okay, Wara. Spice Fender, she's 29. She's Asarai, she's good at trade. Okay, last seen in Sargat today. And, and, and yes, Wara, pretty. Uh, we're going to go see if we can find Wara. We're going to burn some money on the way there, and we might not be in a position to buy our caravan at the end of this stream. But we will get one soon. Probably early next stream, I think. We'll see. We'll see when we get to uh, Sargat how much it costs to conscript the services of Wara. Maybe at a companion limit. Well... It might be it might soon be time to make some difficult cuts. We're going to have to give give our, the rose of our love to one of our competitors here. I'm hostile to where she is. Great. That probably has something to do with that whole kerfuffle with me trying to become that guy's wife. Let's go to Jalmaris and then we'll wrap up the stream for this day. Meme shark. No, I'm a good lord. <laughs> yes. 
I like I like it when games when it is fun when a game shows you the results of your actions and makes you deal with them. That's good gaming. I like that. Um Well, we need to Yeah, okay, we're here now. Let's 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 fill out our diary and then then look at wrapping up for the day. Leave, exit, save and exit. Hello, Queermint. You have once again logged on as we're wrapping up the stream. It's that I'm guessing that that Australian time zone shit once again. Um. Like clockwork. It was a good one today, too. We did a good one today. I'll do a, um... Oh, thank you so much. Rian Sonora gifting that sub to, uh... To Queerman. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. Um... I... I will do a late night weekend stream sometime soon here so that so that people in Europe and uh, other parts of the globe have a better chance of showing up. Maybe, I don't know, maybe this Friday? We'll see. I like to occasionally do a fun late night Friday or Saturday stream if I don't have anything else going on. Which, who the fuck has anything going on? It's pandemic, baby. Hello, toilets. Paper. Welcome. Uh, Alright, exit the game. We will fill out our... our... die... die of re. And then... call it... a night. Let me get on the... let me get on the, the diary... music. Hey everybody. There is another Mountain Blade stream in the books. Uh, we will return to the world of Mountain Blade either on Sunday or sooner than that, depending on what my, my schedule looks like this week. Um...
All right, chat. Vote time. Y'all want uh, art or Tekken? Art or Tekken? Art, art, Tekken, art, art. I think it's going to be art. I have a feeling it's going to be art. Art, art, art. Um, I see another Tekken. Tough choice. I mean, Tekken is art. I'm going to give you all some art tonight. Uh, I'm going to send y'all over to uh, Irene Co. again. I think she's probably doing some more Guilty Gear fan art. And I want you to enjoy looking at it. Thank you very much to Sylph and uh, Jay for hanging out and modding tonight. Thank you everybody for coming through and watching the stream. We will be back soon. Bye-bye.